Hello, hello everyone, what is up? My name is Mosefus and this is Mosefus Games. You're back with Amnesia. The Dark Descent. And I have to remember my controls again because I have not played this game in a good multiple weeks. I think we're trying to get the the orbs. The orb, the orbs, the pieces of the orb. I your guess is as good as mine. Because I don't watch my own videos. Oh god, I forgot I saved here. Hey, Cornelius. Um. No. Not many orbs are left. They sometimes consume themselves. F is lantern. Right is lame. Oh. What is it? Tab? There we go. Like, where is this thing? Okay, so what I was figuring out... Bone covered in... What was I doing? This combination does not work. So the tar should be used to make this. Because Alexander. Oh my god, Cornelius. She still does not shut up. I have notes on torture. Diary. Nope. Mentos. Okay. In the choir... Grippa seeks a note. Thanks, bro. This is supposed to be the choir, right? I'm gonna scream my bloody head off. Okay, a Gripa channels wire. Wire taunts me from the other side. I trust him with my true reason for my efforts. And still, he insists on me releasing a Gripa. How an enlightened man can show such lack of compassion in a seat of power disgusts me. I cannot bring myself to part from a Gripa as he is and has been for centuries my only link to the worlds beyond. Vaya claims he tries his best to release me from my banishment, but they needs me to give him a Gripa. First, so he too can help. If he guarantees success, I would happily oblige, but how am I to part with him if my return might be denied? I know what they are capable of. I have seen their deception. Optimism is a most hopeless feeling, but I must retain it. I shall prepare for his release. To release a Gripa without killing him, Vire told me to feed him a tonic made from a paralyzer, vitae, and tamter. Poisonous fungi should work as paralyzer if I can find the internal gland from large specimen. Quiet seems to be fertile grounds for this sort. I should then be able to extract its contents with the proper tools. The vitae could be extracted as usual from an agonized human victim's blood. I just need large amounts to distill it properly. Remember to collect this during the next torture session. <laughs> Tamter, on the other hand, will prove more difficult. I don't think it exists in this world. Simply writing the word with these letters looks wrong. I believe it's a property of the secretion in the water dwelling cairnk. I will have to address Vire with this as he will have to supply me with a host. Also, a properly prepared well should suffice to contain it. Oh, it's called a kirk. So we technically have that then. Oh my lord, already? Oop. Just chill, thank you. There she is. Yeah, I thought I saw something. I oh, know, that was just my brain. I thought I saw something else glowing. What is this stuff? I don't know what these things are. Like, I, I still don't know what this is. In court, the Order of the Black Eagles spew their politics at each other while I sit quietly in place, willfully forgotten. Once in a while, someone will notice me and lose themselves in a silent cower before regaining their senses? They all know I'm the one and the same Alexander who helped their fathers and grandfathers to found this great order. I've seen them take their fathers' places, and they, too, will grow old and pass away. I remain the same, aged not by time, but by English. Cool, bro. Oh, that's what I saw. I'm like, I saw something over here. Okay, 
Pretty good. Great. Okay. Wire entrance where I'm gonna die. The fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of laudanum in frustration. He smashed it against the bedpost. Candles, if you could all like not go out at once, I would really appreciate that. I feel like I'm crouched. I'm not. I feel really short. Oh, that's fun. Okay, where are we? There's a letter. Anything else? Ceiling stuff. Anything? Okay. Ow! August, what the frick? The blood wards are failing. I can't see. The shadow beckons, and its cry disarms my actions. Hurry. No time to spare. You have to kill another. Alexander produces a knife. He wants me to cut the flesh. Do it. Save yourself. He is a murderer, Daniel. He is evil. A cold-blooded killer. Hurry! Alexander, you must let me be. I have to concentrate. Paint the man, cut the lines, cut the flesh, watch the blood spill, let it come! What? Please, I didn't do anything. Paint the man. The lines, paint the man, cut the lines. Leave the man cries. Ah, ah. Now you see. I did well. One life for another. You hear me, guardian of the orb? I did all this for you. Now, once more. Withdraw your shadow from my domain! Hera? I can't see. Alexander, there isn't much time. I can feel it. We must act swiftly. I will do whatever it takes. What? Ooh. Flowers. Okay. Whoa. Cool. That happened. I hear a child crying. Please, child, do not cry. Ooh, I need you. It. The ritual began? Okay. So. Okay. Was that it for this room? Okay. Ten bucks a month. There's gonna be some here. Ooh. Choir, maybe. It had gone too far. The man was suffocating as he could no longer breathe properly between the lashes. Displeased, he started to look for the Damascus rose oil. Okay. Wow. Um. Where am I? What are my intentions, Daniel? Salvation. It used to be yours. But now you only see just run forward. Revenge. How do you justify your violence? Is it for the greater good? Are you doing the world a service? It is you who caused all this pain and death. If you had accepted your fate and submitted to the orb when you first discovered it, none of this would have happened. It is curiosity in league with your selfishness that is killing us both. Okay. If 
Found a door. Oh, oh, I'm in the wall. Cool. Nope. Oh, look, a molten cow. That was a torture device where they would cook you in the cow. Fun. This is gonna be a grand old time. Oh, the trader did not know what to think of the brass bowl as he was forced to enter it. Only when the heat of fire began to scorch his skin and cook his flesh did he realize it was to be his tomb. His screams of pain echoed inside the brass chamber and traveled through the complex instrument which was the bull's head. Outside the men could hear the brazen bull bellow. I remember reading about this one. Is that... Hera? Oh, cool. Whoa! Call of the Damned? Okay. Ooh, what's this? What are you? Oh! Piece of the orb. Okay, I feel like this is gonna be a very much run and follow the wall, because I don't want to use up what little oil I have. I got one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Let's just go. Fork. Just run. Follow the wall. Follow the wall. Anyone ever remember that show out of the box? Whoa, that's a dead end. Nope. Ooh, tinder box. Give me. Pretty please. Okay, so we went that way. I'm stuck in a corner. Hey, that's very red. That's Mama. She just appeared literally from nowhere. They are close. Okay, thanks. I don't exactly like that, especially since she's like a one-hit kill. So, choir entrance. Okay, so let's go this way then. Let's hug this wall. Okay. Find her. Where? Okay, that's a choir entrance. Shit. Um. Okay, so she's there. Bridges that way. Okay. Okay, I've been here. Mark that as I've been here. Did I go through this door? Was this the door I went through? Dang it. Hope not. Squeeze me. Okay. Okay, this is an Iron Maiden. Okay. So I'm gonna just check all the crevices real fast while I have a moment and pick up. See, the problem is that she one hits me. Like, there is no purpose to that monster. Fork! No, creepy iron maiden. The forger stood absolutely still. The casket had been closed, but a faint light made its way inside. A myriad of spikes pointed at him, glittering as they waited for his body to slip just for a moment. His knee jerked, and he felt blood trickle down his leg. In pain, his head fell slightly forward. It took him a while to realize his eye had ruptured and begun to leak. That's fun. 
cool. Let's hide in there. The bone. I don't want that. Oh, wow, that was weird. Just kind of fell through the world right there. Where was the... So where's the orb? Whoa, I'm like... Glitching a bit right now. Very heavily falling through stuff. Yeah, this is weird. Okay. <sighs> She's gonna be out there, isn't she? This is one way. So I went this way. And the door's over here. I have no idea how or why she spawned. So the door's over here. Here's another bridge. Okay, so I went right. She's gonna be here. I hear her. Fuck. Oh goody. Safety. The wheel is good for keeping your victim still during the procedure. Okay. It can be bound around the circumference or simply stretched across, tying limbs to the spokes and rings. Okay. All tools are by this point useful, and you may administer the torture in any way you like. Oh great. The forte of the wheel is the gaps. When you have decided that the victim shall die. You can smash their limbs with a hammer, making them fold in between the frame. But they'll die. Too quickly, I mean. No, don't worry. The human body is much more resilient. They can survive for days until they finally succumb. I know I shouldn't be playing with this thing, but I'm going to. Murderous limbs are tied to the spokes of the wheel. They turn the wheel slowly, but with intent. So the rope secured around his leg stretched and cracked. The boom. Ooh. He no longer had the strength to scream. The two men looked at each other knowingly and took a hammer and struck the victim's chest in a final act of mercy. That was nice. Okay, so if I do... More appropriate... Oh... So, <sighs> okay, so now if I go straight, she's going to be there. It's okay. Go this way. Mama, please don't hurt me. I hear her. Where's the door? Where's the door? Where's the door? Things are falling from the ceiling. Something died inside of him the day. Watching that man slip away was more than his mind was willing to handle. I still hear like the monster, but I don't think it's just sound effects. I mean, if shit starts exploding, fine. The knife. He reached once more. Ah, we already found that one. Or read that one. Ugh, this, this game just gets me in the pit of my stomach. Every single time. What is screaming at me and why? Ah, yes, I was up. Clever. You found my recipe. Since 
I did. Alexander is working on opening a gate, a door to another realm. It's where he wants to go. Okay. If you could put your anger aside, let him open the portal before you take your revenge. Let me pass this gate then. Please, find the ingredients and prepare the tonic via this guy. And do so before you assemble the ore. The barrier keeping you from the inner sanctum will only be breached for a short time. Unless everything is taken care of before mending the ore, you won't be able to save him. So I could choose to save him. Or not save him, I guess is kind of what just... I wrote something down. Well, how do I get all that stuff, though? Wait, I have to find it in the choir? Where was it in the choir? Well, I have to go back to the torture chamber, it looks like. I don't want to deal with the choir again. Where do I find the Vitae? Vitae, 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 Vitae. What? Jesus Christ, what? What is rumbling and why? Shut up, castle. You're annoying and I hate you. Okay, so how do I not get... How do I get Vitae? Like, how do I get it? Oh wait, can I get it from this dude? Hey buddy. You a viable human. Damn it. Give me your shit. I mean, not literal shit, but you know. Oh, wait. Oh, here we go. Find a way to lower the vessel. Ew! How do I purify it? I see that all the all pieces you need. I know I have no right to ask anything of you. But if you could find it in your heart to gather the ingredients for Vyas Tucker before attempting to mend the all, there might still be a chance for you to save it. How do I purify it, though? My faith is in your hands. How do I purify the blood? And why can't I use a chisel? Shut up. Hmm. Because I have to purify it in the laboratory, right? That's the only logical anything. But how do I get in? Do I check the shovel at it? Booski. Give me my shovel back. Damn it. Stare at the light. Um. Um. Game? Hello? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's cool. Where is this about to spawn me? 
Oh, the last save it had me at. I'll try one more thing. Because anyone else remember seeing fungi anywhere? I saw plants on the ground, but I didn't see fungi. Also, if Mama could, like, chill and not come near me, I'd... God! It's rain, it's gross. That's all I can think of. I don't know what other fungi you're talking about, game. Like... No, oh, please put that away. I'm leaning. Okie dokie. Um, I'm gonna do some research and figure out what I'm supposed to do in this scenario. Because I don't know what their fungi is, and it's supposed to, I think, be in the core, but I don't know where in the core, so I'm gonna have to find it. Guess next time. So, I'm sorry, my arm is so itchy right now. Oh my goodness. My name is Mosfus. This is Mosfus game. I'm itching my arm at the moment. Um, and this has been Amnesia the Dark Descent. If you've enjoyed this game so far, please give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment in the comment section down below if you want to. Oh, sorry, I had to burp. I always had to burp at the worst times. Um, what was I saying? Thumbs up if you liked. Leave a comment in the comment section down below if you haven't already. Please subscribe to the channel so you get notifications on when I post videos because my schedule is going to be shifting slightly since uh, my job is going from part-time to full-time currently. So I'm going to have a little bit different schedule. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you next time on this ooky adventure of Amnesia, the Dark Descent. Bye-bye. Hopefully Mama don't kill us. <laughs>